Who starts at quarterback for Philadelphia next week? Oh, Jalen Hurts. That's an easy question. You know, Doug Peterson said that he needed a spark on their offense, and Jalen Hurts gave him that. I'd argue he was a consistent flame for that offense. Jalen Hurts was the difference for the Philadelphia Eagles yesterday. Now, listen, yes, that was the best coach that they have been all year with the way they ran their RPOs and the way they schemed guys up to get open. Most of their offense was run game or the quarterback outside of the pocket and the defense played really good. But Jalen Hurts was outstanding. He did two things better than, you know, Carson's done this year. One, his decisiveness helped their football team. It got the ball out of his hands. It allowed others to go and make some plays. And then he never hurt their team. You know, his leg said, okay, the flaws of our team or the weakness of our team is our ability to pass, protect, and whatnot. I'm not going to hurt our football team with that way. So you saw a lot of scrambles. You saw a lot of designed runs. And you saw him going, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to allow my athleticism to be something that our team can utilize, our team that it desperately needs right now. So he was more than just a spark. He was a consistent flame and a complete difference maker for their football team. He's their starting quarterback next week. And for the the rest of the season. It certainly feels that way. So Ryan Clark, what does this mean? He was supposed to be a lamb being led to the mm -hmm. slaughter against this really good New Orleans defense yesterday. Mm -hmm. And that would have made it a lot easier in some ways for Doug Peterson. Now what? You know, I'm with you, Greeny. I disagree with Doug Peterson on this being about one person. And that one person isn't about Jalen Hurts. Because I can't necessarily say that Jalen Hurts is the sole reason that this team or the Philadelphia Eagles beat the New Orleans Saints. But I can say that Carson Wentz not being the quarterback is the reason they beat the, Phil the Philadelphia Eagles beat the New Orleans Saints. And you look at the way that Jalen Hurts was able to play. I told you last week, I felt like this was Apollo Creed going to face Ivan Drago at the beginning of Rocky IV. But that's not... <laughs> <laughs> what we saw. We saw that this defense could bleed. We saw that Jalen Hurts, when pressured on 14 plays, they gained 82 yards because he got outside of the pocket. We saw how effective the design quarterback run could be and also the scramble out of the pocket. And Jalen Hurts was poised. Jalen Hurts looked like he was in full command of what Doug Peterson was asking him to do. But everybody else played better. And that's what I mean about Carson Wentz not being the quarterback. Look at the Philadelphia Eagles when they played with Nick Foles, the way the defense stepped up, the run game. We saw some of the same things in Jalen Hurts and the Philadelphia Eagles. Eagles yesterday so the question has to be why is that why is our team better when Carson Wentz isn't the quarterback well that is a question they're going to have to get answered I, I will come back to you on that one in a minute but I did want Rex to ask you because you had some questions about Jalen Hurts and you weren't alone what did he show you yesterday man everything it, it starts first off this is a team win I get it what Doug Peterson's saying but it was inspired by one man and the way he played the poise that he played with, like I question the skill set, man, oh man, I'm not seeing the big picture. The big picture is this guy's a winner. He's got the poise and they did a great job with him. Man, it was college all over. He's running zone reads. This man ran for over 100 yards against a team that hadn't had a 100 yard rusher in 55 straight games. Mm -hmm. So to, I mean, he was amazing in this game. And for those, uh, is he going to be the quarterback next week? Are, are you kidding me? The conversation is going to be, is he going to be the quarterback moving forward, including next year? That's what he's going to try to answer. But I was blown away by this young man's performance. Right. I'm, I'm glad you said I wanted to give you the chance to say it because you had questions and many people yeah. had questions. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.